Hello everyone. It's that time of the year and I am making a stew. So this is a beef stew with just a little bit of beef and what I basically did was, that's a tri-tip, and I sauteed it in a little bit of grapeseed oil, added to salt and pepper, and then I added, while it was still sauteing, um, I added the uh, um, vegetables, which was uh, well, uh, the celery, slice, slices of celery, and onions, and julienne onions, and some bell pepper, and, um, and just added some water because, or you can add some stock if you'd like, prefer. And what I'm going to do is add a couple of, I'd say about a couple tablespoons of the tomato paste, which I like to give it that nice color, and I like to um, give it that, bring those flavors up. And that's, um, and then after I sauteed that, I added my potatoes, and nice big chunks of potatoes, and carrots. Um, basically carrots first and then the along with the bell pepper so it's onions you saute the onions you saute the celery and um, bell peppers and then you add the carrots because they cook a little bit longer and then you add the um, the potatoes the papas and then you go ahead and you add uh, the um, because the potatoes take a little bit longer than cabbage. You add the cabbage and see in all this time, okay, the, the beef is already cooked. So right now it's just simmering in these liquids. And so I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna bring that up a little bit and see how that color changed. And then I'm gonna go ahead and add my zucchini. And those are big, nice, big chunks of zucchini. Now, at this point, if I wanted to, I can add a uh, marinara sauce, or I can add, and in my marinara sauce is um, the cremini mushrooms and the um, zucchini and the eggplant, which gives it a nice, rich flavor. If you want to add that to it, you can. Um, I'm going to go ahead and add some... Some uh, 21 seasonings to that. Oops, dropped the cap. And then you have a nice stew that lasts you for a couple days with the with the beef and the and the tomato paste that gives it a really flavorful stew. And you can add more beef. I just didn't want that much beef. Um, I'd rather have a steak steak. But this is a nice, nice stew that could um, last you for a couple days and um, actually for a week if you want, you know, like a good five days and you can alternate with, um, just make a big pot of it and alternate with some other foods. Um, and just keep that in little containers and store it. Okay, just thought I'd share. If you want to add fresh tomatoes instead of the tomato paste, that would be well, that would be good as well. Or even a uh, pasta sauce would be great. Alrighty, hope that helps.